Hey guys, welcome to another lunch and review. Today I'm going to try these White Castles, the original slider. Uh, these are the hamburgers. Uh, there are six of them in this box. They're 100% beef. Tons of people over the past year probably have recommended that I give these a try. Um, so I thought I would finally bite the bullet and try them out. Um, if you eat the whole package, it's a lot of calories, but um, if you just eat, that was a little bad, didn't see it. Um, if you just eat a package, it's not that bad. So, I just wanted to open it, so I don't know why. So there are, it's 250 calories for two sandwiches or a package of, of hammer, 260. So if you eat two of them, that's what, four, 520, that's a lot. So um, hopefully we'll just eat one. Um, sodium's not bad, nothing's really super bad there. So we're gonna microwave them. You can steam them too, but that's way, I'm not gonna do that. Um, so for best of roll, it's fully thaw in the refrigerator, which these are not, these are still frozen. Um, open end of package, separate them inside the package, microwave for 60 seconds if frozen, 35 if thawed. Um, and like I said, these are straight from frozen, so 60 seconds. So let's see what they look like. Oh, it's not too bad. It's a little thicker than I thought. The burger itself is pretty thin, but uh, yeah, they're, they're uh, not too bad. So basically just open the end of this package. I'll probably put it on a paper plate just so I can grab it out of there pretty easily. And uh, put it in the microwave for 60 and uh, I'll be back. And um, later on I may try them just not reviewed, but just, just as a, uh, just on my own. I'll probably try them thawed just to see if it makes any difference. But, um, but anyway, I'll be right back. All right, here they are out of the microwave and all I did was open the plastic bag. So. Uh, they feel like a typical White Castles. The bun's pretty good and soft. They smell like White Castles. Just to let you know, I haven't had a White Castles in, I couldn't even tell you how long. It's been, it's been at least 10 years um, since I've had a White Castles hamburger. Um, you may have a castle. Some people uh, have castle burgers. Um, White Castles and Castle are the same thing. I'm pretty, or Crystal Burger, I'm sorry. White Castles and Crystals, I think they're the exact same thing. It's just different, uh, different branding. It's just like a Carl Jr.'s and a Hardee's are the same thing. So, uh, so anyway, I'll be back once these cool off for just a second. I'm not going to wait too long because it won't take too long. Okay, it's literally been like five seconds since I put the camera on there. Um, like I said, there's not a lot of meat. I mean, that's pretty tiny. It's thin. I mean, that's not even as thick as my finger. So it's pretty thin hamburger meat. I mean, probably about six pieces of paper is about the same thickness as that. So anyway, here we go. has a good hamburger flavor. I mean, it's a, it's a grilled hamburger, not a charbroiled hamburger. Um, the onions are there. They're, they're always well known for their onions because um, they grill their onions and put them on the burgers. Um, it's good. I think I would um, probably rather have the, like the cheeseburger or fresh out of the package. Um, the bun though, really surprisingly is very tender. You can see it's very soft. It's a little tough, just right there on the skin on the top, but it's pretty tender. The bottom's good and tender. Um, it's a little chewy, maybe. I mean, I can pull it apart pretty easily. It's pretty good. I like the onion flavor. The onions always get me. Um, it's a really good meal. The only bad thing is you only get two of them for 260. So if you're trying to stay low calorie, um, you don't get a lot of food. There's only two burgers, like I said, for 260. And then you'd have to, um, I don't know, eat a fruit or something to add to that if you wanted to be full. But um, overall, pretty good meal. Like I said, I'll probably try these thawed out. I, I bet you that would fix some of the, the little bit of the toughness on the bread. But I'm quite impressed, actually, that it did make them hard. Um, usually when they're frozen and you microwave them, they get very, very hard on the top. Um, these are actually pretty good. They steamed in the package pretty well. So I, I really, I don't have a complaint about them coming straight from frozen. Um, Overall, I'm gonna give these, um, I'll give these a four. They're a really good burger. They're they're not bad, they taste good. They're, they're a lot there um, to add the calories, but beyond that, I mean, it is a cheese, it is a hamburger, so what do you expect? Um, but yeah, I'm gonna give it a four. I would definitely get these again. They don't, they don't taste bad. They don't have a aftertaste or, you know, they don't taste funny or anything like that. So, uh, so anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a like. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. I do videos five days a week, Monday through Friday. And I'll catch you in the next video.